What can we learn from famous last words? The more uh, famous you are, the more well-known you are, the more likely it is that your last words are going to be recorded. It's very likely that your last words are going to be important to people. People are going to want to know what was the last thing he said. Well, this can be very instructive. There is no middle ground when we're talking about the spiritual war that's going on today in this world. There is no middle ground. You are either on God's side or you're on the side of the adversary. Matthew chapter 12, verse 30, he that is not with me is against me, and he that gathers not with me scatters abroad. There is only one truth that does not change, that has not changed, that we have a lifeline out of the turmoil. The atonement and the offering of Christ for the sin of the world is the great argument that the law of God is binding upon every human being. We have the lifeline. The everlasting inheritance is purchased for the elect. Those who will make their election known. Richard Dawkins has stated that there's nothing at all that could ever possibly, nothing could convince him that there is a God. It's not very scientific, is it? Voltaire, the true champion of humanism, he said this, in 20 years' time, Christianity will be no more. Mind you, they've been saying that since the first century. Yet here we are. My single hand shall destroy the edifice it took 12 apostles to rear. Hear the arrogance? Arrogance and the self-confidence. The historian Peter Gar himself, an admirer of Voltaire, described Voltaire's distaste for Christianity as almost an obsession. Repeated and passionately, Voltaire returned to the theme Quote, every sensible man, every honorable man must hold the Christian sect in horror. Did he have a change of tune on his deathbed? Quote, I am abandoned by God and man. Doctor, I'll give you half of what I'm worth if you will give me six months life. And the doctor answered, sir, you cannot live six weeks. And Voltaire replied, then I shall go to hell. And you will go with me. Did he exit his mortal coil in peace? Was that a peaceful end? 